Guys, brand new merch is available right now. All this beautiful stuff right here, if you didn't see it in Thursday's video, it's my favorite one so far. I really love this one, so thank you so much. If you get something, I appreciate it. Just go to codysrunclub.com and uh, thank you. All right, on to the video. Okay, we've been watching too many Americans date on this show. It's time to bring it back to down under. <laughs> That's the phrase, right? Bring it back to down under. It's time to bring it back down under. No, nope, nope, no. no. Anyways, this is the channel that did the Australian button. Today we have 13 women versus one model. This strapping young lad right here, dude's got a couple fucking arms on him, that's for sure. And he made sure to wear the shirt to, to show it. Which, what else would you do on a dating show? Let's watch this man do Tinder in real life. I'd probably say this man will fare pretty well on this show. Hey, he's an attractive guy. That's all I'm saying. Tinder in real life is a funny concept. It seems to be very popular on YouTube, doesn't it? You know, side men do it, a lot of people do it, but it's just the phrase Tinder in real life is funny because it's like, so it's dating. I thought Tinder was dating online, but now that's the norm. So it's like, what if fucking people dated in real life? That's a crazy fucking concept. Let's make that a video. Patrick, hello, Patrick. Hi, my name- That shot was uncomfortably long. <coughs> Alright, Patrick, just do your thing, mate. Just smile that beautiful smile. It's just getting worse. Usually I'm, like, not bad at it, but today, nah. How you going? I'm good, how are you? I'm good, I'm good. Nice to meet you, you're looking nice very you. fine today. I try my best. Nice, the blue eyes matching the blue shirt, I like it. Yep. Thank you. <laughs> oh, that's brutal. Left is bad. Yep. He said, yep. Out. Thank you for the kind words, young lady. Eh. This is harsher than the button, for sure. Just to be distilled down to a... Eh. Like, at least with Tinder, you don't see yourself getting swiped. At least with the button, you have a, the decency of a button press. Not just a fucking hand gesture. Scram. Okay, well, that's... Hi, I'm Malika. How, How are you today? Malika? Good, good. <laughs> Love that. Just walk in front of the camera. Hi. Wait, that way they said, walk down. Sorry, you're supposed to go on the other side. Sorry, let me just. How, How are you doing, Malika? Today? Good. Cross frame right there. <laughs> I love it. I think actually the dude who runs this might have messaged me and was like, oh, you reacted to my video. Thanks or something. I don't know why that's relevant. I just, it's cool that they're like doing this sort of thing, figuring it out, you know? Good, good. Say, so trying to make chocolate vanilla swell. No. <laughs> Hi, I'm Taya. Um... Hang on, Taya. Wait. But she went right. Is it the opposite way in Australia? <laughs> Is right bad? Because they drive on the other side of the road. That's not just a joke about everything being opposite in Australia because it's down and uh, toilets flush the other way. You know, blah, blah, blah. But they do drive on the other side of the road. So maybe on Tinder, users swipe right to like, swipe left to dislike. It's the same. So maybe it's just, you can go either way on this show. I'm good, how are you? I'm good. That's good. Um, I don't have a pickup line, but I kind of do. I can pick you up and we can do lines. <laughs> That's fucking good. <laughs> That's fucking good. I can pick you up and we can do lines. <laughs> That pickup line would work wonders on a cokehead. No. <laughs> Hi, I'm Kira. Hey, young Kira. I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Yeah. New experience for you? Uh. Not me. The set. <laughs> no, it's not no? a new experience. Okay. I like your top. It's busting out. Thanks. It's good. Yeah. Well, I want a new experience, so I'll say yeah. Okay. I don't understand, this fucking right-left thing is throwing me off so much. Okay, so in this show, apparently, left is good, right is bad. That may or may not have something to do with the fact that this is in Australia. I don't know. Or maybe it's the way the show works, but let's just establish that right now. That's how it works. Hi, I'm Jessica. How are you going, Jessica? I'm good, how are you? I'm good, I'm good. What was your name? I'm Patrick. Patrick, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Uh, I have no pickup line either, to be honest. 
You gotta be better than that. Okay. It's a no. <laughs> I mean, yeah, you gotta have a fucking line. You're competing with a whole line of gals. At least throw in a fucking drug reference. Jesus. Hi, I'm Lulu. How you going, Lulu? I'm well, thank you. I have one question. Fucking. Hi, I'm Lulu! Headphone warning. Question for you. What's up? Are you celiac? No, I'm not. Because all I got is cake. Yeah. <laughs> he said, get your ass over there. Get that cake over there. Well, that's a yes. Hi, I'm Ash. How you going, Ash? Right, <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with this mic? <laughs> How the fuck was it so loud for the last person that you can barely hear her? Hi, I'm Micah. Over. Do you want to come to a rave with me later? Bit hungover. Yep. Am I, uh... Am I not worthy of uh, you just being? Why would I try for a guy I don't even know if I'm into? Okay, no. <laughs> Hi, I'm Tamara. How you going, Tamara? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. I just did not come prepared, but um, but but I'm such a good dancer, and I'm so good at yoga, and I'm also good at cooking. Yoga. Yeah. Yes, please. Yay! <laughs> come on, dude. Come on. You think that's just because he does a lot of yoga? Yorga. Yorga? What is yorga? Yorga. You think he's just like, ah, oh, fucking, I needed someone to do Bikram with. None of my homies will do it with me, so please. Yes, please. <laughs> Hi, Maria. How you going, Maria? Good. What's your name? I'm Patrick. You're Patrick? You have a really nice build. Thank you. I, uh, I try my best. I try this. And where are you from? I'm from the west. From I'm from uh, Williamstown. Williamstown. I'm from where we were close. Westy. Yeah. The gum into the mic is a great touch. Don't you love that sound? That's so good. It's such a beautiful sound. He likes it too. He's like, fucking get your ass over there. That way, please. <laughs> Hi, Patrick. I'm Jess. How are you on, Jess? Are you my appendix? Because I don't know what the fuck you do, but I'm trying to take you out. Ha <laughs> ha! I like it. I mean. I know the appendix actually does something, so I'm going to say no. Oh, shit. Hi. How you going? What's your name? I'm Patrick. Patrick. Nice. My name is Davina. Nice How to you meet you. Davina? Good, thank you. What's your first impression? First impression? Yeah. That way. Yeah! Why the applause? What's happening? She didn't even say anything. Pretty cold response by him, to be honest. My first impression is over there. Right, fucking, you know, he did it better than me. <laughs> Pretty cold response. My first impression is you're in. Hey, Patrick. Oh my God, they got a video. That's a quiet now. Hey, Patrick, I'm Ray. How you going, Ray? I'm good, how are you doing? I'm good. So you see what here, and that's what you get. So you liking that? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Thank you. Hi. Nice to meet you. That's okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> nice and forward. All right. Um, so my name is Marilyn. Hey, Marilyn. Do you like women with pretty feet? Women with pretty feet. Pretty feet. Yeah, that way. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? I'm kind of wishing we saw a pickup line ever out of everyone. The last couple were a little weak. Although we know people are fucking obsessed with feet, so that was kind of a good gamble on her part. Because if you get someone that's good with feet, you know, that it's got the feet thing, then you really, all, all you gotta do is be like, you just gotta say the word feet. And they're like, oh, what's up? Yeah, I love you. You got feet? I can suck on them? Yeah, cool. She's the winner. We're gonna end it right now. I'm trying so to Patrick. blind me just looking at the line. How was it? Yeah, it was pretty good. I had a good time. You have to make another decision, mate. Yeah. You have to choose another five. Eight down to five? Yeah. Oh, it's not gonna be easy. I love how awkward this is. It just seems like the producer's like just figuring it out too. He's like, I don't I don't know, right? That five, right? That probably means is that is that half? Something like that. I don't know. Fucking that would be a good thing to do in the video. So yeah, prob probably that I mean listen, take your time, but pick wisely. Alright. I'll try my best. Alright. Right to left or left? They're not gonna do like interviews or something? Or like, if this was actually Tinder in real life, they'd get to say one thing, you know? Maybe have a short little combo and then, and then fucking do the weeding out? Just a suggestion for next time. This video was made a year ago, so maybe you've done that since then. Left to right. 
left to right. I mean, I don't even know which is which anymore. After this, I'm like, what the fuck is real? I don't know. No. Yes. <laughs> yes. No. Yes. 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 No. That was fucking uncomfortable. <coughs> Just barely any, not even, no, like barely any reactions, let alone commentary at all. That felt like a uh, fucking PE class. Someone picking teams in PE class, didn't it? Just the sort of silent, like, fucking come on, pick me, please fucking pick me. I don't want to be embarrassed, come on. I'm pretty good at this game, please. I'm not that bad at fucking curling. That's what we did in our high school. We actually, I actually did have a curling rink in my high school. Hand to God. Now, ladies. God, the sound mixing. Jesus Christ. Here comes the fun part. You guys have to either do one of three things. <laughs> dude, this dude is improving. You guys have to do uh, f uh, fucking okay, one of the uh, three things. Um, fucking uh, kiss each other. Uh, no, I mean no. Write a poem. Porn. Write a rap. Or sing, Patrick. <laughs> You could have planned this out a little bit. A little bit. Write a poem, write a rap, or sing Patrick. Like sing his name, just Patrick. Patrick. Oh, Patrick. Lift, right. You have five minutes to come up with something. Let's go. <laughs> Who's got bars? They're like, what the fuck? What is this? Why did we come here today? I love that you can see that the tripod isn't loosened all the way, so it's like getting stuck <laughs> as they do the pan shot. These shots so long. I love it. I'm sorry I'm picking on the production so much, but it's funny. Okay, thank you. I think we know what's going on. What channel is this again? Quasar? Oh, fuck. Oh, Quasar. <laughs> Quasar transition, still Quasar. It was good. It was, it was fun. fun. Yeah, I liked it. Um, one by one, tell me what you are doing. Yeah, I'm singing a song for Patrick. That's cute, that's cute. Yeah. Uh, I'm s not singing, I wish I was, but um, just a little spoken word rap kind of thing. Sporkin? What's spork? What's sporkin word? We'll see. I'm just gonna be reading out a poem. I'll be reading out a poem. Um, I've got like a few lines for Patrick, so I wrote a little rap. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Uh, Patrick looking fantastic. Honestly, the whole time I just drew a picture. So. If Patrick wants a poem, I'll do a poem. If you want a song, I'll do a song. If you want a rap, I'll do a rap. Complete silence? Complete and utter silence? You couldn't even throw in the classic music back there again? Oh, fuck. Hey, Patrick, this is a song that I remixed for you. Originally, it's Beyonce, Say My Name, but right now it's Patrick, Say My Name. Please be able to sing, please. 
please. Say my name, say my name, when no one is around you. Say, baby, I love you if you ain't running game. Say my name, say my name, these bitches are not for you. I'm the one that knows you, better say my name. Say my name, say my name, when cameras are not rolling. My heart, you have stolen, baby, say my name, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, okay. <laughs> okay. I don't know. Was it good? I'm confused. Some parts were really good, and then other parts were not so good, but I mean, the lyrics were good. I'd say that's a fucking solid 7 out of 10. You said you wanted a new experience, so pick me and I'll help you feel it. Chocolate brown curls, hip dips down my waist. Looking through your radiant eyes, I can see a longing for a taste. Okay, okay, I guess. <laughs> Five out of ten, I would say. It takes a lot of fucking balls to write a poem and recite it to a person, though. So I give her credit for that. <laughs> Mine's a little bit more lovey-dovey, so. Cupid hit me with precision. I wondered if you looked both ways when you crossed my mind. I'm sick, I'm sick, I'm sick of chasing. <laughs> oh, I should do it slam poetry. <laughs> I wonder if you look both ways before you cross my mind. I'm sick, I'm sick, I'm sick! I'm sick of not having your love. You're the one that's always running through my daydream. I can only see your face when I close my eyes. Can I get a kiss and let's make it last forever? Sound like an EDM song. Goddamn. Four out of ten. Oh my god. I'm gonna follow that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so tan line, big curves, and the energy glows. I mean, I just wrote this, so I hope it flows. Go, ghost, if you like, make sure the door don't hit you, but I'm Ray, so nice to meet you. Okay, rap, poem, or song? Oh, I don't know. No reaction to that one at all. <laughs> they just completely, she started and finished and they just went into the next one. Not a single applause, nothing. Not a single clap, I mean. She didn't get a single standing ovation. What does the, what does the board say? If it says a cat, then, I don't know, just improvise. What do you feel? I'll do a rap. Do a rap. Okay. Um. Ready? Shit. Okay. She said, shit. <laughs> don't propose it if you don't, if you're not ready to do it. I should have written something. Um, okay. <laughs> okay, um, okay. Sitting here on the white floor, looking at you when I'm looking at the door, but... Wait, no, let me start again. Wait. <laughs> <sighs> Fuck. Picture didn't really cut it, eh? Gotta wish you used the time a little wiser. I was doing such good ones before. Okay, you got blonde hair and blue eyes. When I look at your eyes, I think of the skies. And then when I think of the skies, I think of flying. But I don't want to fly because I want to be dying. Fucking end with a suicide bar. Boom. Mic drop. How you like that? He's like, are you good? Are you okay? That was a really dark ending. You want to be dying? That's how you're going to end your verse to me? You should have kept going. I'm dying to get to know you. Boom. Mic, that would be a mic drop. Or just be like, Petri, come trying to sick dick. <laughs> Petri, I'm trying to seek your dick. <laughs> <laughs> she lost the mic. She was like, get it away. That was a bar. So, uh, that was a bar. Just two? All right, just two. I can't go past the Beyonce, uh, the Beyonce rework, so yes. And and yes. All right. Oh fuck! I forgot what channel this was. <laughs> so I'm happy they brought that back. Oh okay, it's Quasar. Okay, okay. I was transitioning a little too soon. I was like, what channel? Fuck! I didn't get that. But I'm so happy it went back to the title card, Quasar. Obama. The fuck is this? Yeah. Uh -huh. 
I hope you guys made it to that. That was a year ago, so I hope that was fun, I guess. That event. What channel? Oh, Quasar. Hi. How you going? Grace, was it? No. Wow, that's really embarrassing. Good start. No. Name? Just so I don't forget this time. Say it three times, okay? Yeah. Divina. Divina. That's one. One. Again. Divina. One more time. Divina. Perfect. Grace. Divina. Oh, this is rough. Holy shit. This is rough. Not a lot of sparks flying right now. How you going? Don't play with me. Huh? Mm-mm. I just, I'm fun like that. You're fun. Yeah, I'll call you Grace one more time. <laughs> no, I'd do that. <laughs> so, tell me about yourself. Well, um... Which I love that he, she, they didn't mic her up. Like, she's holding... It's so awkward to hold a mic on a one-on-one -on -one date. <laughs> like, you're fucking, like, doing stand-up directly to him. I mean, I guess they, she just performed a poem to him. This is probably better than that. Check, check, is this thing on? Because I'm dumb turned on. For you. <laughs> Anyways, what was your name again? Part. It's a broad question. Where are you from? Philippines. Philippines? Mm -hmm. When did you come over here? Or were you born here? No, I came here when I was nine. Oh, no shit. Mm -hmm. um, How about you? Well... He said, no shit. Um... Fucking, I don't, don't I... No more questions, I don't know. I got nothing else. Uh, oh shit! Nine. Okay. Um, fucking what else? I'm uh, born and raised in Western suburbs. Okay. Mum's German. My dad's great granddad's a convict, so mm -hmm. half really Australian, half half German. Beautiful. Have you visited back in Germany? No. I think it's no. still a bit too risky. Really? Blonde hair, blue eyes. Oh, <laughs> that's still a thing. Still a thing? Did you really just ask that? Oh fuck, is fucking Hitler still doing his thing over there? Or what's up? Mm. Is that an assumption or is that a it's real an assumption. fact? Okay. So I'll stay away from there. Alright, have you traveled much? Yeah, I went to been to South America, I've been to been to South America, been to Japan, been to Vietnam, mostly Asia. Perfect. But not the Philippines. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. That works perfectly because this is a job interview. That's what this is right now. This is just horribly awkward. Holy shit. I kind of want to fast forward through this. It's rough as hell. This is not flirting in the slightest. Paints yet. That's okay. As long as you have a taste for Asia. I definitely do. Perfect. Okay, this is a little flirt, I guess. Um, are your piercings visible right now? Oh, that is the follow-up to where you're from? At least she was like, okay, the next f natural follow-up is have you traveled somewhere cool? How is the next question after that, are all your piercings visible right now? That is the horniest fucking question in the world. Yes. They are? I took the last couple out. How come? Funny story, actually. There was a, a rib issue that I had, and I had to get a scan, and I forgot that they were there. And they're like, they you have piercings? Yesterday. And I was like, yo, I do. So I had to take it off, unfortunately. Poor thing. Yeah. So just that, no, nothing lower? Oh, God. Oh, this is fucking gross. This dude's horny as hell. This dude was probably a menace on real Tinder. This is what he's like in real life dating? Imagine him just dating. <laughs> online you know like the normal kind are all your piercings visible right now she's like you can't see you can't see me is that a common thing for women to pierce lower i mean belly button no no all right mm -hmm. then is that a thing for you is that a fact? yeah that's what he was talking about the belly button for sure that's what he was talking about ish is that why you're asking or more curiosity curiosity so what does that tell you about a person what does it tell me about a person mm -hmm. why is it a specific question you chose to ask Cause I want to know if your clit was pierced. That's what fucking, that's what he's, he's screaming in his own head. So first date, dude, pump the brakes a little bit. Um, I don't know, just sometimes. Just I don't know, maybe cause I'm horny. I think it's just cause I'm horny. So it tells me you've, uh, 
you were curious and now you're just uh, dipping back into something a bit more tamer now. Tamer. So what are you looking for? What am I looking for? Yeah. Hmm. Holy fucking shit, this is painful. Oh my god. Um, the bar is really high, so I'm gonna need to see that. I can't tell you how to act. I just gotta analyze the way you behave. And Otherwise, if I tell right you now. what I want, you start to act the way I want you to, rather than... Yeah, it's very true. Right? People just love exactly. Um, what do you do, by the way? I model. Model. Yeah. Well, it's pretty safe to say he's not like a scientist, you know? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I feel like I'm being mean to him, but... He is a little bit overly horny, which is like, you know, I feel like if you're... If you look like this... It's like, you're probably not used to getting rejected, so. So I'm not defending the piercing question by any mean, but it, I'm just saying it makes sense. What was the latest job that you did? Workwear. So, do you know Bad Workwear, the clothing company? I actually don't. You don't know? Mm -mm. Yeah, so. Are they, they an like Australian that. brand, or? Yeah. Okay. One minute what, to go. What, now? Oh. Dude, he doesn't have another question! He literally has done that like five times! Oh, fuck, okay. What? Just ask her literally anything! He's like, I fucking already did the piercing one. That's like, hold on. Um, fucking, um... Do you like to sick dick? Uh, fucking, um... Uh, where are you from? No, I already said that. Uh... Piercing, I already did that one. Um... Do you wanna fuck? Or... Or do you... Are you down to fuck? That's a question, right? That's cool. Did I already ask that one? No, I didn't, okay. Do you want to fuck? Um, yeah, time for me to ask you a question now. Yeah, probably. I think that's probably probably the time for it. If you had like you've had like five minutes to do that. He's like, sorry, I'm just not used to having to ask other people questions. Um, oh, I got a question. What do I do for a living? Oh, thank you for asking. I'm a model. <laughs> What's your biggest ick in a guy? Biggest ick. Oh, that was so Australian. Hygiene. If Hygiene. Do not, if I check your bathroom and it's not at all clean or there's just toothpaste mark toothpaste mark everywhere on the, just, on the fucking yes, on the mirror that's not it for oh me i'm God. just no and if your car mm -mm. what do you drive alexis. so you got a clean car yes a alexis god damn um god i know how you feel about the, the bathroom my housemate is a fucking mess okay so mm -hmm. um, what else what's your ick about a girl Thank you, holy fuck, please let this end. I can't even believe I haven't scrubbed through this. I'm just fucking eating this bad fucking footage right now. This man really just rolled with it. I respect his positive attitude in the face of some truly miserable people. That's how I feel about us right now. We're just fucking rolling with this. Honesty, just not being honest. I, I don't know if that's- that's Bare minimum. That is a bare minimum, yeah. isn't it? One last question, what was uh, the first thing you noticed about me? First thing I noticed? Be honest, completely honest, because your ick was honesty. Are they real? Oh my god, dude. He really- I- I re I was literally gonna say, you borbs. I was gonna call back that- the borbs joke from whenever I did that last. He actually did it. He took the words out of my mouth. First thing I noticed, you borbs. You borbies. You borbs. <laughs> So fucking loud for no reason. Is that important? Is that important? No. It's just the first thing I noticed. You asked. Good. It's a good, honest question. First thing I thought is, you are fucking gorgeous. <laughs> Thank you. And then are they real? Okay. If that suffices. It does. Oh my god, holy shit. You should have just said that in the beginning. You are fucking gorgeous. All that riffraff in the back right there, that's so funny. All those guys just like, I can't believe you fucking asked that, mate. I can't believe, I know, mate. I can't believe you fucking asked that, mate. I know. What a legend. That was probably some of some of the worst flirt. I've watched a lot of fucking dating shows on here. And so have you. Vis-a-vis, vis -a vis, -a vis -a me vis-a-vis me via me that was some of the worst flirting some of the worst game i've ever seen in my entire life it is true i feel like like this dude probably doesn't really need game that probably just works for him but that was horrendous he thought he was killing it too are they real you asked me to be honest that's not that's horrible um i really like the eye contact for sure 
There was intensity there, which was good. Made me question his misogynistic mindset, though, with the last comment. But we can, we'll see, we'll see. Babes, I already won. So whatever, like, he chooses, I win. Because I think I'm great. So. Babes, 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 I already won. Be a good sport. How are you going? Good, how are you? I'm good, good to see you back here. Thank you, I'm glad to be here. Do you remember my name? It's not Grace, by the way. Yeah, it's Davina. You're dumb. You're dumb. You're stupid. Um, no, it's not. I know. I'll give you another try, go. Holy shit. Oh my god, it just does not get better. Oh my god. I think we can just kind of fucking power through this together. We're gonna all need to just... A little moral support right now to get through this. This is fucking rough. First letter? There are a lot of names. You literally had two girls come to the final. You only had to remember two names. He couldn't have fucking asked the producer before, like, wait, what the fuck is her name again? Okay, cool. Like, literally, that's all it would have taken. No. Yeah, you did. My name is Rafara, don't forget it. I'm not Rafara. gonna say it twice. No, yeah. I won't forget it. Yeah, okay. So, why are you here? Why am I here? Yeah, if you're not gonna remember girls' names, why are you here? Well, I'll remember it now. Okay. I mean, I'll say it a lot of times later. This is the horniest dude in the world. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, you're smooth, you're smooth. That's not smooth! He's just hot. It's not smooth at all. So what are you looking for? Well, it's a bit of fun, bit of love, bit of both. Okay. Uh, for your undercarriage to be pierced. Taint piercings, butt piercings, taint piercings, um, toe piercings, um, just piercings below the belt in general. Yeah. Because, I don't know, you can't go out with someone and that shit be boring, so. Unless they're boring. You can't go out with someone if they're boring. If so. they're boring, I agree. I hate boring niggas, but you're not a nigga, so I can't really say that. But. Have you ever been with a black woman before? I have. You have? I have. Why is that a red flag? It's kind of giving jungle fever. Because the last two people, you got a Filipino queen and now you got a Zimbabwean goddess. What are you gonna do with both that? Do you feel me? Both of that? Yeah. Like those are the two people you chose, so I'm a bit suspicious. What do you mean, what am I gonna do with that? Like why? Like why, like what was the reason, what did you see in me that made you want to choose me? You could fucking sing. Yeah, and? And, you know, it was pretty fucking good. Yeah, and? <laughs> um. Honestly, that's, that's like it. I just, you know, the voice, just really, that's it. And uh, you, what did you say about the piercing thing again? Pretty crazy to roast him for choosing her. That's some crazy game right there that I don't understand at all. Basically calling him racist? in a way, right? Is that what just happened? Wild as hell. You know, if you're looking to like make him look kind of like a fool, I guess that's a good way to go. But if you're looking to go on a date with him, that's a crazy move. I don't know, I like your smile. Wow, so you think I'm ugly? I can't win this. <laughs> <laughs> no, for real. So- No, you're definitely not ugly. Thank you. So you model? I do. I model as well. What, like what shoots have you done? Who do you work for? Prove it, name three models. Name three shoots. Name three pictures, please. Prove it. No, name three pictures. Name three poses, right now. Name them. I can disclose some, but I can't disclose others. It's on the DL. On NDA. the DLs, yeah. Okay. NDAs, so. So, uh, did, what did I do? Did a brewery last week, you know, Cooper's Brewery. Yeah. So it's gonna be uh, like some limited edition stuff. Yeah. And then, yeah, the workwear as well. So. That's sick. Yeah, that's all I can disclose right now. Is that your passion? Uh, I can't do that forever. Not yet. Right, not so yet. I mean, I'll do it right now, but... Yeah, so then what is, like, your grind? Like, what's your passion? Holy fucking shit. Oh, my God. This music is making it worse. It's, like, putting me to sleep. So why would I be with a man who doesn't have, like, a focus? That's a good point. Like, why are you just modeling for fun? Like, what do you actually want to do? I mean, I can have, I can have all the fun that I want, but yeah. I want to get into politics. In politics? Yeah. Okay, I love politics. Where, where do you lean, left? I love politics. 
This is a great discussion for a first date. I love politics. It's such a funny phrase. I love politics. Oh, fucking politics? Oh, fuck yeah. People don't talk enough about politics these days. I fucking love that. Right. Where do I leave? Yeah. Yeah. Left. Left. Left? The, the correct answer. Okay, okay, so... Yeah, but we know that left is opposite, so that must mean right! So in five years, you see yourself doing what? I see myself being a criminal justice lawyer in a law, law firm. So you're going to uni or... Yeah, I'm going to start. Cool. Eventually. Okay, take this as motivation. Yeah, I think I might. Okay, so you're not going to find a fine girl if you don't have a hustle. That's a good point. Yeah, exactly. Okay, now you have to ask me. <laughs> She's coaching him through. This is how you have a date. Now you ask me a question. Where am I going to be in five years? Where are you going to be then? I'm going to be famous. You're going to be famous? And rich. Doing what? Retiring early. Everything. Singing. But you have to be doing something. Acting. First. Movies. All of that. All of that? Yeah. yeah. Do some acting. So what yeah. movies you've been um, I haven't been in movies yet. I do music videos right now. I haven't been cast in a movie, but just you wait. I'll be next to Zendaya. Ooh. Yeah. Game respects game. It does. All right. So. Once a cheater, always a cheater. I think people can change, but I think if you cheated, like... Oh, fuck, my bad, sorry. Oh, fuck. Oh my god, I was asleep for 45 fucking minutes. Holy shit, okay, let's keep going. On me or in my proximity, I'll never trust you again. Like, I know they can change, but I'm not gonna trust you like that again, do you feel me? Yeah. 10 seconds, please fucking wrap it up. You know what I mean? Yeah, I agree. I think people can change, but sometimes it's, some stuff's just too deeply rooted. To exactly. Be, um, to change. Exactly. Yeah, like like how you forgot my problem. name. Huh? I think the date was okay, like, between you and me on the DL, the conversation was dead. Yes, oh my god, I agree. I felt like I was carrying it, and I felt like he didn't have any game, and he wasn't putting me in my place enough, like, I need a man who's gonna tell me, like, when I need to settle down, and I was being a bit outrageous, and I was trying to make him say something like, Bitch, stop, like relax, because I'm trying to have that kind of relationship with my mans. But he just let me keep running my mouth, and I got kind of bored, so then I just kept saying out of pocket shit. Um, but other than that, it was really good. Patrick. What's up? How, how's it going? Other than that, it was really good. <laughs> other than the only thing I was looking for, which didn't happen, it was really great other than that. AKA, he's hot. I'm good, man. I had some fun today. Yeah? Yeah. Have you made a decision? I have made my decision. Yeah. How do you, have you really thought about it? I thought long and hard. Uh, we all fucking know who he's gonna choose, God damn it! The first girl, the girl that he said the boob thing to. Cause he's fucking horny, and that's what he's gonna do. Uh, she sounded worldly. She sounded, uh, yeah, she's... Really worldly? A person experienced and sophisticated. Invested in my time, invested in what I said, and mm -hmm. I, uh, yeah, I was interested in what she, uh, what she brought to the table as well. And she, you know, she kept me in line as well, so. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Before you make this, your decision, did you hear what they had to say about you? I did. Yeah, everyone's in the same room together. <laughs> no green rooms here. No, everyone's just standing right there. Well, you know, nobody's perfect, so I forgive them. But... <laughs> <laughs> cut. But... Are we doing it right now? Don't call yeah. cut. <laughs> Why did they leave that in? Oh my god. Haha. <laughs> ha. Cut. No, we're going to keep rolling. Oh, uh, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Patrick. I, Patrick, make your decision now. Uh, Patrick, are you fucking... Uh, okay, 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 make your decision. I've chosen Davina. Woo! I mean, we could have seen that fucking coming. That's all right. How you going? Great. How do you feel? <laughs> Great. No difference. All right, sweet. So so that sounds uh, reassuring. Patrick, you win this $100 um, prize. <laughs> you win this. Dude, I love this. This is so fucking scoffed. You win this uh, fucking, what is this again? Oh, it's a prize, right? <laughs> you have one job, dude, one job. You can either take her out on a beautiful date or you can take her yourself. What do you do? I reckon she can pick the place, she can pick the time, and uh, 
Sounds like I'll be the one paying. Yeah. <laughs> Holy fucking shit, that was a roller coaster. I hated most of that. That sucked. So happy for them though. Truly some of the worst flirting I've ever seen in my entire life. And I'm so happy that's I'm over. Goodbye. Home.